My darlings, we are back with Fire Pit Fun with Faye. And I don't even want to introduce it anymore. I just want to get into the clips because this week was explosive in Love Island and I absolutely loved it. There was so much drama and just roll them. Just roll them because I want to get into them. Okay? Okay. And then how do I hold it with both hands? Mm -hmm. I'm off for a wee and then I might come join you. Okay. Come on, so. Oh, oh my God, look, 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 look. Am I the only one that absolutely loved Molly for this absolute iconic clip where she just goes and joins them in the gym and stares at them? I feel like that's me when I just stalk somebody's Instagram on their stories. So I'm here for it. Also, I feel like Charlotte, she should have also gone harder. Go harder on my like, wife sit there. Is there nowhere else you want to stand today? But also as well, everyone else getting involved, I'm not really sure on it. I just feel like let them have the drama. Let us see the drama. But I love it. Molly basically may as well have been in the bushes. Wait, was it you that said the game player one to me? Yeah. Why was that? I feel like Mitch was out of the loop for so long. You probably could have told him sooner. You know, no, he was I... in my head until I knew that he wasn't in my head. Here at Love Island HQ, we love a game player. But also, are we forgetting that we're in week two? Why can no one just go and get to know people about being a game player? Also, as well, if Molly was a game player, I would be saying she'd be sticking with Mitch because she'd be like, oh, we're together from the start. I want to make everyone happy. No, I've got no time for Mitch, so I think, Molly, do it, do it harder. You basically implied that it was once to go to Molly. I don't think she's two-faced at all. And if I did, I'd tell her. I don't think she's two-faced. I think she's been honest with her feelings. But I'm saying, moving forward, that cut all the whispers girls out. Like, you know no what I mean? No one's whispering now. You're no one's whispering. I love this clip. Catherine, yeah, you call out the dirt and I'm here for it. Jess, I absolutely love you. I think you bring so much to the villa and you are my girl. I will back you. But there were whispers. Let's just admit it and move on. And you did also call her two face. I'm just saying, I saw it, I saw it here on TV that you said that, and you were on the day beds with Mitch when you said it. Why couldn't have you just had the decency just as a genuine person to just come to me and be like, yeah, and by the way, I'm just flirting with you for fun, because I just feel like you're wasting my time. Like, I'm not that girl and I've not come in here for that. And I feel like it's really upset me that you stood up there and called me a test, because, like, I'm a human, I have feelings. Yeah, I'm sure you do, but at the end of the day, it's not my problem. I've been honest with everyone. Oh, get out, Sammy. I honestly, we all saw you. We've all been watching you. As soon as Jess left this villa to go on a date, you were straight in there with Leah. No, we're not having it. Leah, we've got your back, and how nice it to see a girl that's brought her backbone in with her. And she's like, I'm not taking this. No, good for you. I'm, I feel like she came in, she was very sweet, she was very innocent. I really like Leah. Um, but I'm just glad we're seeing a different side of her. Like, no, I'm not taking this crap. Good for you. Sammy, get out. Get out. Take Mitch. Get out. That's it for this week. But I'm, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to next week's already. I'm really into it. I just want to judge everyone.